Hi, I'm Stacy, and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a come and shop with me at Target plus a Target haul. Um, I actually filmed a Target haul a few weeks ago, but there were so many issues with the video. It was shaky, and then when I went to export the cutaways to my MacBook, like I couldn't figure it out. It wouldn't go. I was just like, so I wasn't able to post that one because I did have a video. I've been gone for a few weeks. Um, but that one didn't work out, so I've just kind of been dark. My AC in my house was not working. I was fighting with my insurance company, so it was out for about maybe two weekends. So that made it really hard to film with the lights and everything. It was already hot down. It was already hot downstairs, and you know, I I just couldn't be bothered to to do it because I was just so just disgusted by it. So anyway, everything's fixed now. Work has been crazy. Um, so I just wasn't really able to film before, but you know what? I'm back on track. I'm here. Um, I'm going to take you guys with me to Target. There will be some things that, um, I'll show you that I've already gotten because I already have it. And then when we're in Target, you know, if I already have it, I'll let you guys know that as we're shopping. It's going to be so much fun. Um, yeah, so let's go. And, but before we do, let me just let you know what I have on today. I just have on a two-piece, it's just a sweatshirt from the H&M Tom Kango line um, that came out maybe a month or two ago. I'm not 100% sure. I have on the matching sweatpants. I will show you guys my full outfit. And I have on today, Mincet. It is called Black of the Berry. And I love it. I'm like super obsessed with it. I'm thinking I'm gonna order a backup of it because this will probably be um, my fall color um, of the year. So love it, love it. It's called Minted. And I will leave the information down in the description box. So if you haven't already, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. So let's get started. Come on, let's go. It's actually really pretty today outside. It's, it's gorgeous, so. All right, let me just show you guys what I'm actually going to return. Well, this one's an exchange. Um, this, they had this last year from Who What Wear, and it's just a little like, sort of a mock neck with voluminous sleeves here. And I really do like it. I'm just gonna exchange it for a medium. It's a small, and the small does fit, but I like this to be somewhat oversized, so that's an exchange. I like this a lot, but I am returning it because this is a, this is a new drop from Who What Wear as well. I saw it in the other Target, not the Target in my house, and I do like it a lot. But I have I have a lot of animal print, so I just can't justify the purchase. But this is a really nice piece. It's super soft. I think it's $32.99. If you do not have anything like this in your wardrobe, I would recommend it. It was just, this is just a product of me just doing way too much. So that's that. Now, this is what I'm the most disappointing about. This is another top from Who What Wear. It's like a sweatshirt. It has puffy sleeves. It's really cute. You see, you know, it's just adorable. And they have, it has matching pants. I am keeping the pants because they are cute. But these arms are like way too short. Like, and I don't know, maybe as I've gotten older, I've realized that maybe I do have like alien arms or something. I don't know, but they're too short. And this is a small, so I just figured it just wasn't meant to be. And I'm gonna keep the mock necks. I'll wear the mock neck. Um, with the pants that I have, and the same thing with the gray. I mean, I love that one. I don't know. I mean, maybe I'll see if I can find a bigger size, but the arms are just way too short. And I was just like, yeah, no. So again, I have the matching pants to this one, but I have the mock neck in this, the same as the black one already. So I was just gonna wear the pants with that one. So it's a matter of not if I decide to just go ahead and try and get a bigger size if they have this in stock. If not, then I'll just return that and keep it moving as well. And then this was really cute. It's like a little two-piece situation here. And it has little shoulder pads here. It's like a more of a fitted style. 
the material is like probably like a polyester and it has like little matching pants here you guys can see that little matching like wide leg pants if I see it in the store, I'll show it to you. I mean, it was good in theory, but when I tried it on, I looked like I was a cast member of Star Trek. So I was like, you know what? No, never mind. So that's what I'm returning. So I'll return that and then I'll, I'll take you guys along with me whenever we start shopping. All right, so I'm on my way to Target right now. I'm about to take you guys inside, um, see what they have, um, see what's new, see what I would recommend. So get ready. Okay, the first thing I normally do is I usually go to like see if they have whites or Lysol. Uh, probably not, but you know, it's always worth a shot. So here we go on that one. Target is limiting the Clorox wipes to one per person. Normally it's two, but now they're doing one. But they do have a lot here, so hmm. yeah. really Lysol is what I'm on the hunt for because you know my work situation has been crazy and I need Lysol at my work because we've had several breakouts, COVID breakouts in my particular area. So I was able to find some Lysol um, at another place, but I think that was just God's divine intervention because he knew <laughs> I was going to be in a situation where I was going to be fighting COVID by myself. But yeah, so anyway, let's go on to look and see what they have in makeup. So I'm actually looking for something specific there. They do sell the lip bar at this location and I actually need to pick this up. This is something. I don't have any lip gloss, believe it or not. Sometimes you just want a little bit of something to fit in shop or like a little neat shade like this. This is nice. Have this one. Drama Queen, I do. I have that one already. Um, I think I may have this one too. So. so, I guess we'll start off in shoes since we're going to hit shoes up before we hit up any of the apparel because of the way that we're going. So, We'll see about that. I actually really haven't been a fan of their shoes. I used to buy at least a couple, I'd say a couple pairs of shoes from Target each season, but I really just haven't been into it. I feel like they really haven't been current enough. They usually are better with, with trends, but not this year for me. Their stuff's really dated to me. Like, even this, like, yeah, I get that, you know, Leopard is in, but you know, where's the square toe? Like, square toe was in starting last season, so I would expect that they would have at least some square toe in the assortment, and there's none at all. Like, they're all round toe. I mean, even a little bit square toe. Like, I thought that was very, I don't know. They just seem to be not on top of the trends like they used to be. Like, their footwear assortment has definitely changed. No, man, these are ugly. What is this? This is so ugly to me. Like, who's wearing that? Who's wearing that? I don't know. So weird. <sighs> Looks and mess per usual. Here's my outfit of the day. I just have on um, what you does H&M X Tango um, with the matching pants. And then I have on my little. Ramex 97s. I wore these earlier this week. I posted a picture. And then I just have on my Prada 
something on the fence about these pants. I think because I bought a similar pair of pants last season and these do look better made. I'm not gonna lie, I think I might get these. I need a size four, so it used to be a size two, but not anymore. Not anymore. Now, they have like these little turtleneck dresses with the billowy sleeves. They have the polka dot one here. And they also have this little black and white cheetah one here with the contrast black neck which i like and they have this new light corduroy it looks like cup sleeve dress i'm not really a big fan of that i don't know i just i'm not really a huge fan of corduroy unless it's in the blazer this is the sweater that i'm returning which i told you that i thought was really nice i like it i just feel like i didn't need it because i already have so much animal print in my in my um wardrobe now I just didn't I couldn't justify it and oh I did get this I do have that one so I guess I'm doing my haul right now I'm showing you guys what I bought I, bought, I thought it was cute I love the tan and the hot pink I think it's just a nice cozy oversized neck to throw on that's very different from what you're seeing and then I also have this little it's in a size large, so it's a little bit large, but this cardigan here, which I like. I got it in the tan and then the purple. Um, the purple in this back here. I think it's, I think they call it the grandma sweater, but it has like little puppy sleeves here. These little ball action that I like. The buttons are super cute. I've already worn the tan one. And I highly recommend that. These, I think, are $35. So, highly recommend it. I also picked up this sweater. This is most large, but I've gotten one in a small, puffy sleeves with the exaggerated collar, like the little Peter Pan collars, which are so in right now. I just thought that was really cute and very on trend. So, this is a definite automatic pickup. They have it in another color as well. I don't know if they have it here, but I thought this was the best color. And I don't see it at all. I'm going to have some more dresses over here. Let's go see what they have. So, and this is the dress that I had on the other day. You guys like that too. It's cute. It's $37. Definitely recommend it. Um, yeah, and then they also have like a little polka dot situation here. Just a nice little sweater here. So I think it's really cute. I just don't need another sweater. And then they have like this little puffer jacket here and that same like print, which is adorable. This is absolutely adorable. I love it. Love it a lot. Another thing that I think you guys should look at is the prologue. I bought this dress here not too long ago. I think it's really cute. It's just like a sweater dress. And again, you know I'm all about sweater dresses. It has like the little, the little, little sleeve here. It's super long. I got in an extra small. The sizing is very generous. I think this is $40. So yeah, I think it's super worth it. So check out your local Target on that one. This is another dress that I highly recommend. I have it. This is a good quality sweater dress. It's long. It has sort of like a zigzag ribbing down the side, ribbing down the dress. Um, it's really thick. This is $40 as well. But yeah, it's, I, I highly recommend it. I was like, you should pick that up. I wish I had it in another color because I would definitely buy it. But I already have this one. I bought this one a while ago. This, this one was featured in my video that I picked up with. And then have some like other dresses here, like this little leather more like more of a shirt dress here, which is actually not bad in a tan colorway. I think because it's already so wrinkled, it would be um it would just be madness trying to steam that. So I don't know about that. Oh, this is cute. What is this? 
What is she? What is she? Cute color. Sleeves. She's nice. I like her. Oh, I like her. She wants to go to a nice dinner. She's very chic. Very chic. Oh, let me see if they have my size. Probably not, because that's the one thing. They do not carry a lot of small sizes, and this stuff is very much, in my opinion, oversized. Sizing is very good. Now, another like little shirt dress. I can easily be seen. That's cute, but that's not something that I would wear for winter. So long dress here. Not nothing too interesting. Some nice sweaters. This is a nice little mint, sort of sage green. This looks massive. It's an extra, extra large. I don't see even massive or extra, extra large, but yeah, they do. Oh, look at the green. Look at the green, Stacey. Let's look at this. That's cute. That's different, too. Hmm, it's way really different. And honestly, I could do this. With this little cognac here. Look at that combo. Isn't that great? I'm getting that. Definitely. This is good, guys, too. They're giving you Isabelle Morant with these sleeves. I actually have the same one, but not in this color. I wish I had this color, actually, but they don't have my size. But I got it in black. This was in the original haul that I wasn't able to upload. So, yeah, they have some really good things here. What's this one here? Oh, see? This is that same, like, little sage. Minute top. Like it's it's just this is nice. I really wish I had it in my size, and they don't. There's like one XXL over there, and that's it. That's really cute. I even like how they styled her. So she looks cute. And then see how she styled the little Isabel Moran as sweater. I really do like that a lot. To the point where I'm going to go back and see if I missed my size, and I know I didn't, but just in case because no, they don't. And they and their stuff's cut too big. I can't get away with it. No, they don't. Oh, guys, too. I bought these little chocolate joggers, which I really did like. And these are $19.99, so that's $20. A really good find because they have them in black and in that colorway. And I think she might have them on right there with that little sweatshirt. But you see how... This is style, just a basic top with just the faux leather joggers. It's just an instantly chic look. You don't have to do too much when it comes down to faux leather at all. They do sell Levi's in this store, and they do have in the men's section, and they do have like the cutest trucker jackets. These are eighty dollars but i love them with the fleece i love i really do like the fleece line jackets and i really like them on men i have one that's black but i don't have one that's blue but yeah i think these are super cute i love 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 a charter jacket like this on a, on a guy i think it looks super dope they have other ones too they have this little khaki color one as well. I like the blue jean one better. It's an oversized black denim. And they just kind of have like a little denim sweatshirt. Not denim, but little sweatshirts. I have a good selection of denim here. There's little gold shirts, which I like. It's a nice t-shirt, actually. I have one in a small. Me too. I should make all this in a weird election day. It's a little big though. I think I still want to buy it. 
Levi's. This one nice. Nice. Sweatshirts. They have a good selection here. I mean, it pretty much covers up half of the apparel pack. Okay, so I'm back at the house several hours later. And I did want to show you guys some of the things that I have been getting from Target over the past, I'd say, several weeks, as well as I'm going to show you what I bought this last trip. So the first thing, which I did not see there, which I'm actually so glad that I got this from the Target that's by my job, is this cardigan. This houndstooth cardigan is everything. Look at these buttons. This is insane. This is so good. I love it. I can't wait to mix and match this with the, the pants that I um, had on. I'll insert a picture of my houndstooth outfit that I wore this week. And I also have the skirt. I mean, it's just, I can't believe this isn't everywhere, but it's not. It wasn't even in my local Target. It was in a Target by my job. But I love this. It has pockets here. I mean, this is just well done. It's super soft. And I like this so much that I also have it in this colorway, which this hot pink is just their signature color, I, I guess, this season. But I love it. I'm not mad at it at all. I mean, it is just, again, it still has the gold button details here. It has pockets. I mean, this is good, guys. Like, this is so good. I would this is definitely something that i would put in my wardrobe um this fall winter because it's just it's super chic and house tooth never ever goes out of style so i got those and i also have a couple of things that i haven't tried on yet so bear with me on that you guys know that i love a good like knitted dress i found these from a new day it's this ribbed dress it's ribbing all around Let's see if you can kind of see the material here it's super thick guys like look at that material there it's a thick material it's long sleeves it's long so it's more of a it might be longer than that it may be a maxi if it's not it's a mini i think maybe it's a no this is a this is a maxi this is a maxi long knitted dress i have not tried this on i got this in a an extra small so I'll see I think the extra small is going to be fine because it's kind of thick usually whenever you know there's like more of a this is not really form-fitting but it's a little bit close closer to the body I usually go up a size but this was really thick so I thought that it would probably be okay to kind of do my true size with who what where and as a matter of fact this was only $24.99 for 99 guys I don't know if you can see that but so yeah I love it I thought it was super good and I cannot wait to wear it and I like it so much so I got it in this pretty like teal green colorway like is this not gorgeous again got this long sleeve but it's not super thick so you can kind of wear it now when it's kind of like in that in between stages or whatever because it's not a turtleneck or anything like that but it's making noise but yeah so again I just Look at the material, like $24.99. Like, this is a great deal. And you guys know that I am obsessed with like knit and sweater dresses. Like I, I'm gonna live in them the entire um the entire year. This is something you can put with a cute pair of booties, like those little kind of um snakeskin, like yellow boots that I got from um, who was the name of that um brand? I forget the name of it, but that'll be cute with this color, like oh, the yellow against with this. That's insane. You can put this with a pair of sneakers. You can put this with um, your your platform flat boots. Um, well, low boots, shall I say? You can put them with um, with high boots, with low boots, with sneakers. I mean, the possibilities are just are endless. They are endless. You know, if you have that Prada boot or a Prada dupe boot, the high one with the little pouches on there, that'll be cute with that to kind of like edge it up a little bit with like a little leather jacket. So I, I highly suggest both of those. I think it comes in a, a third color as well. It might come in black. I'm not sure, um, but I would highly, highly recommend that.
And then, so next I just got, I rebought these pants <laughs> in a small. Um, these are just a little sweat pants that I got from Who What Wear. Initially, um, there was a matching, which I'm going to show you next, the matching sweatshirt with the little Diamante um, sleeve. And it, it was just too, the, the sleeves were just too short. Like I said, I don't know if I'm an alien or what, but I just think that my arms are really long. I never really thought that they were longer than average, but I feel like they may be because that's really short. So I, um, I rebought the pants because I decided to go ahead and buy a, and just go ahead and buy the larger size so i actually skipped up two sizes because initially um i i think it goes it goes from extra small to maybe extra large so i just went ahead and went from the small because that was the original one with the short sleeves to like a a large so i even skipped the medium because i said you know what i'd rather just be like super oversized i think i would rather wear it like that and even now this kind of looks like it's not going to be as it, it will be because i'm like so look at that I mean, it should still be fine now. I'm gonna try it on, it's lit. But I just figured it was better to have it super oversized. And I kinda like the look of that anyway. Um, but I love the detail on this one. This is actually a real like um, button here. It's a real opening, it's not fake at all. I, it has puff sleeves here. This is what, why I was attracted to it. And then, um, I ended up getting also this little, which I was trying to show you guys, but unsuccessfully. And I got this in a size medium. A little like mock neck. It's not really a full turtleneck shirt. It has just like the little poofy sleeves here. I just like the idea of wearing this with the pants here. Or I just with a simple pair of like jeans. I mean, you can put this with jeans. You can put this with a pair of faux leather leggings. I mean, the possibilities are endless. And I just like the idea of being able to match this up, like mix and match like this, the sweatshirt and like the sweatpants together. You know, I think that's just a, a cool look. So I went ahead and did that. And I won't show you, but I bought, well, you know, essentially I bought the large of uh, this sweatshirt here in gray because I already had the pants. So again, you know, I was just gonna just mix and match because I already have the gray, like that mock neck. I, I, I own that, I just didn't show, I don't think you guys need to see that one, but, or would wanna see that one, but yeah. So again, just gonna, you know, wear it oversized. I think that's the better way to go because I really do like the idea of that. And it's super soft on the inside, so I need something cozy. So I figured this would be something that was really easy to throw on like on the weekends. And then what's the next? Oh yeah. You guys know I did pick up this leather leather shirt. I love it. It's like volum again with the voluminous sleeves. Like that's insane to me. I love that a lot. Voluminous sleeves. Just I love the green. I think this green is super pretty. And again, I think I can mix and match it with this. This little cognac leather pant. I got this in a size four. I did have the pant that they had last year, but I like this one a little bit better. I think the cut's better. It's more of a, I would say more of a mom fit, which I like. So the other one wasn't like that. I think it was a little bit more tapered. But this one, even though it's tapered, it's still more flattering, I think. So I decided to go ahead and pick this one up. And again, I'm just seeing people style this so well. So I just, I, I think that was the right thing to do because I've been contemplating it, you know, for the past several weeks now. And then I also got, the last thing I got was this Vogue t-shirt by Levi's. It's a little bit oversized, but I will be wearing this under a blazer on um, Super Tuesday. So I'm looking forward to that for numerous reasons. So anyway, um, that is my haul for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. You know, let me know in the comment section, you know, if you enjoyed this style of, of vlog, you know, slash haul. I know, you know, sometimes the camera might be a little bit shaky or I might not have necessarily been in focus as much. 
So just work with me on that one. I'll get better as I do more of them. But yeah, so just let me know in the comments how you um how you enjoy that, if that's something that you want me to do more of or less of or whatever. But so anyway, I will talk to you later. Have a good weekend.